Hi everyone, Chetch here. As usual, timestamps in the description below and on the scroll bar. Quick announcement, uh, and about five hours from now, I will be doing a six, seven, maybe eight hour live stream. Um, it is my 10 year anniversary of playing League of Legends, so I'm going to be playing all 10 placement games for the ranked season. I know, I waited six months just for this. I hate myself too. So, follow, come watch me at twitch.tv slash edge. I'll make an announcement in the community post as well if you want to watch it. Um, come see me rage and stuff. I don't know, maybe. Or maybe win a lot, hopefully. Anyway, uh, let's get started. We have a gotcha. Hinier de Fleece Pier, but it's a new recolor gotcha. And um, a lot of people are uh, getting angry with three colors, especially with the recent event, Luminous Ocean. Um, being a one of the, uh, whatever the Aries theme was before but yeah so let's get some new colors in our life it's black and white so everything's black and white there's no gray in between nope none of that also it's 90 degrees today <laughs> it was 89 last night I wanted to die it's so hot um, I was speaking with friends about this, and like they were like, "Oh, I mean, because like, they they asked me like, oh, what's the average there um, for like the summer?" And I'm like, "Oh, it's uh, you know, like seventy to eighty ish." And like, "Oh, so it's normal?" It's like, "No, it's not normal. It's still spring. It's not summer. It's supposed to be raining." <sighs> no, we have um, ninety degree weather. In May. <gasps> Secret rare animation, let's go. A rare. Your profile. Green. So yeah. Living my best life, clearly. Oh yeah, it's so hot. Climate change ain't real, but like here in Washington, the weather's just been so chaotic for the past few years. It makes no sense. Like we've had like warm hot weather before and like especially when we uh, before we moved out where we are right now we still live in Washington but we were closer to Seattle the house we had was a flat roof so it didn't like push the heat away it, it absorbed it and it transferred it through our house so it was hot like that but it wasn't hot in the sense of what we're feeling now because I, I, I the first time I ever experienced this type of heat was when I went to uh, California for Anime Expo, and it was a hundred, I think it was like 106 degrees there. It was my first time ever experiencing that, and I could not handle it, especially in a cosplay. So, fun stuff. But, I don't know. The thing is, and something else you have to consider too, and I always have to remind myself about this, is that there are people who are used to that heat, and there are people who aren't. So, um, like, obviously if you, like, live in a more tepid climate, like, I would say Washington is, it's like, okay, you can understand that, but then you go south where it's all desert and warm, arid areas, and, like, oh, they're used to heat, but someone from up here or even further north, so up in, like, Alaska, they just go there, it's like a... 180 and it's like oh my god so hot I can't stand this. Remember to trade in your items for any of these as well. Fun. So yeah. But. Just heat waves and then a bunch of snowstorms. And we've had like snowstorms before and not like excessive snow. It's just like oh it's very very hot. Oh and then it's very very cold huh. I think you've got quite a collection here don't you? But this is the work of a goddess after all, right? Maybe she's just slacking off. Lana, you're so naive. You don't need a reason to help people. Yes, Elsa, and you'll get a nice gift too. Go, go, don't, yeah, don't say that. Yep, she'll get a gift. I don't know if I got 400 or not. Who knows?
Okay, so they are doing a, re a remix of the decor item. Also, nice that we can get a 10 play ticket from these instead of, you know, just regular ones. But, um. Yeah, so we are bringing the decor of this. And then we have the frame and the, um. Items here. Was it here that had it? Or was it the ranking? I remember something had like the decor. Yeah, this one right here, the frame. So, yeah, I guess we can get that. This is blue, not green. Hmm. Um. Yeah, so. Hyper Lens and Time Bonus, and then Regular Lens and Time Bonus. Good luck to everyone. And I think that will be it. Oh, we, oh, we have to chat. Oh, I think I know what it is. I think it's. Okay, wait one second. Um, Natalie, I've set your model on my show. Hello again, sent you blessings and hearts. Thank you very much, Natalie. I appreciate it. Um, Adrena, hello, I saw your YouTube channel. Thank you very much, Adrena, for uh, watching my YouTube channel. I was thinking of doing, because that's the humor asking me to do certain videos to help them with stuff. I'm like, yeah, I guess I can do this. I was going to try and make shorts um, on certain topics, one being the um, how to change your language. Because that one seems to be an issue for a lot of people. Uh, but thank you. And then Chandelure. Hello, Judge. Hope you're having a good weekend. I just want to say that you're the only one, who, or you're the one who introduced me to the cookbook play. Ever since that, I've been playing this game for a few years now. Thank you very much, Chandelure. Um, I don't know if you were following me beforehand from like Tales Runner or a game before then, Battleborn. Um, but I'm glad you enjoyed this game and I hope you continue playing it and hopefully. Cocoa uh, Coco Pup Play continues to be a huge success. And then Mr. Cutie. Hello, Shares. Long time, as I say. Now, have you? how have you been? I know I say, do you, I do enjoy your daily videos and how much time and effort you put into it. I hope your day is going well. Thank you very much, Mr. Cutie. Yeah, I've been trying to do daily videos on my other channel with shorts. Um, so, trying to see if that can boost me up or something. I don't know. But thank you very much, Mr. Peter. I always appreciate you, especially everyone in the Dreamy family. Um, but uh, I wish you the best. I've been struggling with life um, as usual because my mom's in the hospital and she keeps thinking that she's going to get out and she keeps lying and just saying all the stuff where she's just getting food from friends, but she's not supposed to have food. She's supposed to be on a liquid diet and it's just chaotic mess and she's not taking care of herself seriously and like I want to be sympathetic to her but the more she does this the more she gets uh, the uh, medical professionals angry with her and then that comes back to us where they just direct it at my sister and I and they yell at us and scold us and all this stuff and it's like I don't know what to do anyway um but yeah thank you for checking in Mr. Kitty hope you're going well make sure to like your posts on Twitter and whatnot I think that will be it, except please do remember, um, we still have the rice cake event going on, so be sure to turn in any rice cakes you get to Elisa, not Coco. Um, that will be ending at the end of the delivery event, and then, um, the Gacha Festival will be re resetting probably, and then, yeah, remember that I will be streaming later on for, um, League of Legends, 10 placement games. Ooh, for my 10 year anniversary um come watch that otherwise good luck in your gotcha spins hopefully they are luckier than mine good luck in the delivery events good luck in the uh children's day events golden week event and gotcha festival and good luck in life happy mother's day i'll see you all in the next one poof poof <laughs>